The Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Adamo Estate, says it has concluded arrangements to expand polling units following the directives by the national chairman of the commission. The resident electoral commissioner in Adamo Estate, Kasim Gaidam, who announced this in Yola during the stakeholders' meeting, said the engagement is mainly targeted at taking the polling units closer to the voters. Here's the report as presented from our studios. Since the completion of the 2019 general elections in Adamawa State, this is the first time that INEC is organizing such an event which brought about all stakeholders together to inform them of the need for the expansion of the polling units. The resident electoral commissioner Kasim Gaydam said that they are taking such steps to decongest the polling unit with many voter points and to address the big challenge of poor turnout during elections. The polling units we are talking about are the 2,609 polling units in Adamawa State, as well as the voting points. In Adamawa State for the 2019 general election, we had 1,495 polling units, voting points. And it is this 1,495 voting points that will now be combated into stand-alone polling units. Some of the participants who applauded the effort of the INEC described the event as timely as it will go a long way in carrying people at the grassroots along. It's uh, long-awaited because this has to do with the election, forthcoming general election. Uh, it is a declaration or expansion of more polling units. I think INEC has done the needful for organizing such an interactive session. As you can see, so many questions are being raised, and we hopefully we are trying to see how we can get the solutions to the questions raised. In most cases, try as much as possible to get in touch with security agencies. Take permission before you can hold that meeting, because one, the security agency is there to give you protection. If there is any problem, you could easily run to security. So do not run away from us, because we are partners in progress. Well, this meeting at Damar State will now have additional polling units of 4,104, which will give those at the grassroots the opportunity to participate fully in the coming 2023 general elections without much comment. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.